5 on RTV6. And now at 5, from the football stadium to the legal arena, Colts linebacker Josh McNary in a whole different spotlight, making his initial court appearance today on rape charges. We have team coverage as new developments unfold. Josh McNary is out of jail tonight after appearing before a judge this afternoon. It is just one of the many developments in this case since we first told you about it 24 hours ago. RTV6 reporter Chris Prophet was in the courtroom and joins us live outside the city county building with the very latest developments. Chris. And McNary and his attorney didn't talk to reporters going in or out of court. Now, in addition to that not guilty plea, he was also ordered not to have any contact with the alleged victim. We want to go to video taken earlier today here at the city county building, dressed in a gray suit. McNary and his attorney entered the criminal court just before one for that initial hearing. The Colts player charged with one count of rape, one count of criminal conduct, and one count of battery. A 29 year old woman tells police that she met McNary on December 1st at a downtown bar after a long night of drinking. He then took her to his apartment and allegedly raped her. While the case has generated a lot of publicity, prosecutors say they will treat it as any other criminal case. I think it makes it more difficult uh, for any alleged victim to feel that um, her case uh, can remain private because this is a crime that was committed upon her, so it makes it more difficult for her. It doesn't make it more difficult for us. We work hard in every single case, whether there's a camera in my face or not. And McNary's attorney issued a statement earlier today saying that the linebacker denies all the accusations that have been made against him. Now, also, in addition to him being out on bond, he must wear a GPS monitoring device until his jury trial in March. Live downtown, Chris Prophet, RTV6.